Hey everybody, um, just a real quick video. <clears throat> this is not going to be anything super groundbreaking, but uh, I just upgraded to Unraid version 6.7, and uh, I was running great on, I think it was 6.7, or no, 6.6.7 .6 or something like that before. It was fine, um, but it just released officially the stable version and everything I upgraded. Um, I'm running the CA Fixed Common Problems plugin, and I got a just whole slew of notifications saying um let's see what they are and i'll show you they changed the icon on me all right so i have a bunch of discs i have 30 discs and two are parity and the rest are let's see we've got 24 on a lsi 920116e and then we've got a few on the onboard SAS of the GA7PSH2. And then I've got a couple on the onboard SATA of the GA7PSH2. Basically, all of the disks that are here are on the, uh, the 16E on the external in my DAS. And it says, you may experience slow read read writes on disk one, write cache should be enabled for better results. Post your diagnostics, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, okay, why the hell didn't you tell me about this in the previous version of Unraid? Like I've been using it for a while now and you know, why didn't you tell me about it? So I don't know why it didn't tell me, but here we are. So it turns out this is a relatively common thing um basically you just have to I, there's two different commands you're gonna have to google the one for sata um this is the one for sas controllers and i think sas drives but i in my case i'm using sata drives so i, I think it's just for sas controllers um but this is the detect uh like wc zero that means it's right cache is uh disabled Basically, you want it to be WCE1. Um, <clears throat> so we're going to run this command on a couple drives. I'll show you how that works. Uh, make sure that all of your drives are sp spun up, because otherwise it's not going to detect whether it has write cache enabled or not. So we're going to go to the terminal here. And the command is... Uh, there. Okay, so we'll do, I don't know, my parity disk. SDM. Yep, zero, turned off. Okay. So the next command is... This. Oops. So I already did it for D, I suppose, and then uh, I just did it for M, which is the parity drive. So we can go up and check to see parity. Oh, look, right cache is enabled now. So I have to go through and enable it on all of them. Um, I wish that Unraid, the previous version of Unraid and CA Fix Common Problems told me about this uh, because I would have just simply done it and it wouldn't have been that big of a deal. But it's nice that I know about it now. Um, so yeah, if you're experiencing slow read writes for whatever reason, uh, try running this command to detect whether you have write caching enabled or disabled per disk, and that should help you solve that problem. Um, <clears throat> what was I gonna say? Oh, uh, this should be a persistent change. You shouldn't have to do this after every reboot of Unraid or anything like that. So once it's set, it should be set um, so that should ultimately solve your problem. Uh, I think it's good practice generally to do this um, regardless of whether you get the notification or not because it seems that on previous versions of Unraid you don't get the notification at all. So uh, take this with a grain of salt. Hopefully this helps somebody. And uh, yeah, sorry for the quick little video here, but um, like I said, uh, hopefully it helps someone and I'll see you guys next time.